better mate just testing out this uh, this Kingfisher 14 foot kayak from uh, Bluefin Kayaks uh, they asked me to do a video do a bit of re a review for it uh, so I've got it out on river uh, I'm gonna try and catch some fish and then later on I'll give you a bit of a review of what I've uh, what I've found of it Okay, starting from front of the kayak, got your handle at front and a little storage bungee area. You've got a large um, compartment here which is quite handy. It's quite a large area there to put your, put your bits and bobs in. Um, even better, you can take that out. And inside there is hollow, so you've got a lot of storage there if you needed to put all sorts in. You could put your coat in there and all sorts. I've, put, I've been putting my uh, camera tripod in there, so that's, that's quite a large one. Moving further back, we've got a centre console. Place for your bottle. And all these here, so you can basically customise it with various um, centre console attachments. Easy to put your fish finder on it, cameras. All the rest. Yeah, that strap's closed. To secure it just to hold it tight. And when you undo that, you've got a long storage compartment inside there. So, got a lot more space on this one for storage. Also, on this one, you've got two two rod holders. Um, adjustable. Undo that. back on this one which makes it good for any longer rods again we've got the central little storage compartment and again that's a removable one if you needed to Removable one to get in there. Moving to the back, we've got the same seat as before. Um, two more rod rests. And at the back, you've just got miles more storage. Uh, the centre, that's sort of the, the rear storage is just massive. Uh, my other one would have come to about there. So you've got an extra, I've just got loads of room. Absolutely loads of room. Um, and you'll spot at the back there. I'll explain that in a second. So what you've got here is adjustable adjustable footrest. Turn a little handle. And 
adjust it to your size and put a lock in, lock in place. So that's much better for, for comfort. But the top part is actually for this part of the, pe of the pedal. It's actually a controller. At the side of you, you've got a little pulley mechanism, basically. And as you pull your, your rope, that flips down. Then you lock that in place. Lock it's down. You lock that in place. Just in there. Keeps that tight. You use your foot pedals. Not to paddle, but to steer that rudder. It'll help turn your kayak. So Will and Charlotte at Bluefin Kayak asked me to um, test out this new Kingfisher kayak that they've got, 14 foot. Um, it's a bit more of a uh, bit more of an expensive, um, better suited fishing fishing kayak, um, and it's got it's got its it's got its bonuses and it's got its negative bits for me. Um, but then said ne them negative bits for me personally might be better for somebody else. So um, first thing. It's a lot, it's a lot larger, so you, obviously where you're going to store it, it's a bit different. I can, I can throw my 10 foot in back in my car uh, as this 14 foot of water, so it has to go on the roof. Um, now getting it on and off, on and off the roof, uh, is not that easy. I mean, I've got some, you've seen my guns, I've got some big guns, and um, so an average, average guy probably wouldn't be able to lift it. I manage it because I'm, I'm quite a strong guy, um, and I'm a bit of an athlete. Uh, but if, you, if you're knocking on a bit, then it's not the one for you. Unless um, you think you'll go out with somebody else as well. If you go out with somebody else too, if you can lift it, no problem. Um, my, my 10 footer, I can, I can lift it on off car really easy. Um, like I say this wood's a lot heavier. Uh, and that's the same for um, your access to, the, to, your, uh, to your spots. If you're going to be um, putting, on a, putting on a trolley, and wheeling it to a lake, and it's it's bang on. If you if you can it up and down a, a river banking, uh, it's not that easy. Uh, I have got it in. I've got to get it back out yet, but I think I will do. It's not easy where I have. So you've got to think about where you're going to launch it. Um, like I say, if it's two years, it's a bit easier. But, uh, if you're on your own, then you'll struggle. However, that said, this kayak is is not really for what what I use my kayak for. My kayak, I use it for. You're just chucking it down a bank and then jumping in it and, and fishing a little little stretch. This is a lot bigger, and I'd probably say it's a, more of a, a big lake um, kayak. It's a lot more sturdy, um, miles sturdier than the, than the other one. And the other, the, the other one I've got is, is, is bang on, but this one's just a lot more solid um, and take a lot more weight. So if you are a bit of a chunky person, if you're six foot five and 19 stone, uh, you probably want this one. You don't want the, the other one that I've got. Uh, this one's probably a lot better for you. A lot more room. If you've got long legs, plenty of room. I, I mean, I'm I'm nearly what am I? Five twelve, um, and I've still got another seven or eight, seven inches um, space for my legs. So it's a lot. It's a lot better if you if you're the big guy. This is the one you want. Um, Manoeuvrability uh, because it's longer. Uh, it, it's um, at less of a turning circle, so it's not as not as manoeuvrable. That said, it does it just turn around okay. You've got your uh, your rudder that helps you as well. That'll help you turn. You won't turn as, as good as you can in, in a smaller kayak. However, the the benefit of this one is it, it keeps straight. My kayak um, it sort of turns one way and turns the other as, you, as your as your pedal as you're paddling, and it sort of does that in the water. This one just keeps straight. You've got that rudder, uh, and you've got a longer body on it. It sits in the water well, and it, and it keeps it a lot straighter. So um, it's good for that. Um, Storage wise, you've just got miles more storage on this one. If you're, um, let's say, you're, you're somebody who takes a lot of um, um, 
a lot of rods, uh, a lot of a lot of equipment, food, bait, um, everything. Then this is the one for you. There's a lot more room in it. You've just got so much storage. If you want to kit it out um, with all your fish finder and everything, then this is bang on because you've got so much more you can you can add to it and customise it. Um, the one I use, I if you notice, I, I haven't put a fish finder in it. You can put a fish finder in it. I know um, Ben. Uh, one of the lads that we go, he's, he's um, put his fish finder in, uh, he's done that, but like I said, this one's, this one's made easier for you. Uh, and it's just bigger, a bigger kayak, so it's, you've got to think about what, what you're going to use it for. Um, if you're going to use it for, for lakes, this is your one, a lot more sturdy. Uh, if you're going to be doing like I do, fishing rivers and canals, then uh, you don't want this one because it's, it's hard to get it in the water. So it's, pretty, it's still pretty manoeuvrable, even though it's a, a longer kayak. So you can spin it round and that, you can control it. You can move it easy enough, it's not, it's not hard to, to get in places. Um, just a lot bigger, a lot sturdier. I mean, really, really solid on this one. Um, the, only, the only difference that I did was my, my custom made. Um, Anchor is I basically doubled it up because it's quite a bigger one. You're getting a bit of flowing water. You need to have a bit of weight. So there's nearly there's nearly I think there's two and a half kilogram there. So um, and that keeps me from from drifting. Um, on, on my on my own I've only got one of those. So and that, and that keeps me still most of the time. Yes, yeah, so it's a real good kayak. Um, if, you, if you wasn't sure about using the smaller one, if you didn't think it was for you. Uh, this is this is a, the next option. Got a lot more, a lot more. Um, get some bobs on it. Take it for a spin. You can have a look. Not as nimble. Uh, it's a lot easier to get it out of. A lot more solid, a lot more, lot more stable. So yeah, there you have it. Um, 14 foot kingfish here. I'll be sending this one back um, to Will and Charlotte at Bluefin. Um, but if you want one, get in touch with them. And they'll sort you out. They'll tell you exactly which one you want. 